Hello, you're welcome. How to solve this nice exponential equation? Solution from here. And what we have here, this follows when we have a times a, we can express it as a squared. Also, same thing multiplying, we can write it as 3 raised to the power x all squared equals to 19 on this side. Then, next step, this follows when we have a raised to the power m or raised to the power m. This same thing as a raised to the power m n. Now this, this power multiplies, and we have 3 raised to the power 2x equals to 90 on this side. The next step here, we take the log on both sides. Here we have log 3 raised to the power 2x equals to log 90 from here. Then here we apply the power law of log room. When we have log n raised to the power p, this same thing as p log n. That is here, this becomes 2x log 3 equals to log 90 on this side. The next step here, we divide this side by log 3. Divide this side by log 3. Also divide this side by log 3, which implies log 3 cancel each other here, and we have 2x equals to log 19 over log 3. Then, next step here, we can rewrite 90 as 9 times 10, which implies 2x equals to log 9 times 10 over log 3. Then, yeah, this follows from when we have log a times b, which can be expressed as log a plus log b. That is, what we have here becomes 2x equals to log 9 plus log 10 over log 3. Then, next step here, we separate this into two fractions and we have 2x equals to log 9 over log 3 plus log 10 over log 3 and also here 10 can be expressed as 2 times 5 which implies this becomes 2x equals to log 9 over log 3 plus log 2 times 5 over log 3 then this also follows the law of logarithm and we have 2x equals to log 9 over log 3 plus log 2 plus log 5 over log 3. That is here. We separate this into two fractions and we have 2x equals to log 9 over log 3 plus log 2 over log 3 plus log 5 over log 3. Then, yeah, also, 9 can be written as 3 times 3, that's 3 squared. That is, here yeah, we have 2x equals to log 3 squared over log 3 plus log 2 over log 3 plus log 5 over log 3. Then we apply the power of logarithm here. 2 comes in. 
we have 2x equals to 2 log 3 over log 3 plus log 2 over log 3 plus log 5 over log 3. Then, here we have log 3 cancelled each other. And 2 left here. That is 2x equals to 2 plus log 2 over log 3 plus log 5 over log 3. Then also here we apply change of this. When we have log A over log B, this is the same thing as log A to base B. Then this becomes 2x equals to 2 plus log 2 base 3 plus log 5 base 3. Yeah. Then we divide both side by 2. And let's divide this side by 2. Also divide this side by 2. Here, yeah, 2 cancel with each other. And we have x equals to 2 plus log 2 base 3 plus log 5 base 3 all over 2. So here we have the value of x. Then let's check if this satisfies this given problem. That is to substitute the value of x into this given problem. Then we have from the solution x equals to 2 plus log 2 base 3 plus log 5 base 3 all over 2. When we substitute here, what we have becomes 3 raised to power. 2 plus log 2 base 3 plus log 5 base 3 all over 2 times also 3 raised to the power 2 plus log 2 base 3 plus log 5 base 3 all over 2 this is equals to 90 on this side then here, yeah, this we have seen base multiplying when we have a raised to the power n times a raised to the power also same power n. This same thing as a raised to the power n plus n does 2n. And this here we have 3 raised to the power 2 times 2 plus log 2 base 3 plus log 5 base 3 all over 2. This is equals to 90 on this side. Then this power multiplies 2 here cancel each other. We have 3 raised to the power 2 plus log 2 base 3 plus log 5 base 3. This is equals to 90 on this side. Then we follow the law of indices here and this becomes 3 squared times 3 raised to the power log. 2 base 3 times 3 raised to the power log 5 base 3 this is equals to 90 on this side and 3 square here that's 9 then times here follows on we have a raised to the power log b to base a which is equals to b and this here we have 2 then times here 5 this is equals to 90 on this side and 2 times 5, 10. 10 times 9, that's 90, which is equal to 90 from here. Left hand side equals to the right hand side. And therefore, we conclude here that x equals to 2 plus log 2 base 3 plus log 5 base 3 all over 2. Satisfy this given problem. And thank you for watching. Don't forget the steps. Subscribe for more videos and turn your notification bell. Share this video with your friends. See you next lesson. Bye for now.